It's a year welcomed with eagerness. A year anticipated with high hopes of abundance, restoration, prosperity, and amelioration. Claimed to be that year for everyone to reconstruct themselves in all possible aspects, build rooms for innovation, and design a life worth living. But then, why is the outside world quiet? Why is it that the streets seemed empty? Why is it that we have to protect ourselves from air? Little did we know, the world became a victim of this chaos and turmoil. We became a victim of COVID-19. Hopeless as we watched this virus reach the headlines of news. Cower as the death toll takes its peak. Unemployment is upon most people. Locked in like birds in cages. Anticipation, the hope, vanquished in an instant. But how, from whence did this ballad of despair come from? It turns out, this sorry state of humans was the result of animals. Specifically the animals that carry the communicable virus that is now known as COVID-19. Simply put it this way, the health of the environment, animals, and humans are interconnected. If ever either one of these aspects is greatly affected, the others would also take damage. Seemingly like dominoes, wherein if one falls, the rest would also collapse. This entwined relationship is called One Health. As it deteriorates, it then causes the diseases of animals to mutate, which turned out to be a communicable disease to humans. Humans now have to take precaution of this disease and must formulate a concoction that could cure it. This agony, the chaos, it all boils down to the actions of humans. There's only one thing we can do to stop hellish situations like this from ever happening again. That is for me aware. Awareness is the very first step of prevention. We must first acknowledge that the relation between humans, animals, and the environment exists. We now live in an age where information is a click of a button away to be obsessed. We, in our own ways, will be equipped with knowledge to take on this massive dilemma with one small step at a time. In this world filled with the same cycling problems, your small, thoughtful action can be the big difference this world was looking for.